Place Line Tool. Basically, it's the same tool as your Smart Line Tool, but without the functionality of the option to change your vertex type or change your segment types and so forth. Kind of just a watered down version of your Smart Line Tool. You can get to the Place Line Tool here in your main toolbar, or you can also go to your Construction Tools and get the Place Line Tool right here. Like I said, it's just a watered down version of your Place Smart Line Tool. You do have the options to check mark a length or an angle in here, which is an option that you can do, but a better option instead of doing that is using your Anchor Draw Tool in conjunction with the Place Line Tool to draw your lines with a little bit more precision where you can actually tell it the length of where it should go at what angle if you want it you know, locked into your Y axis or X axis and so forth and that's discussed in the, um, the AccuDraw tools that are out there. So we're just going to leave those unchecked for right now. Another thing to keep in mind is we try to tell everyone to use the place line tool in conjunction with the AccuDraw but if you do come in here and check mark these boxes and you try to use AccuDraw in conjunction with another tool like the place line tool whatever you have check marked in this box here is going to override what you try to put in for your AccuDraw settings and like I said this is discussed in the AccuDraw section so I'll go ahead and leave those unchecked very similar like what the place smart line tool is you identify where you want to start the line at left click go to the next point left click you want to keep going and keep data clicking or left clicking until you're finished. Once you're done with it, right click to reset it and you're finished. Of course, if you use your element selection tool or try to delete something, it's just going to delete out one element because there's no option to tie them together or join elements. So I'll go back to my place line tool. Like I said, you can come in here and put in a length if you really wanted to. Let's say 10. I'll tab to lock it in. And now if I come on here and draw, it's going to be a unit of 10. Okay. It is an option that you can do, but like I said, it's a better method is use AccuDraw in conjunction with your place line tool to draw your lines with precision.